So, new tutorial. This tutorial is about how to apply a shader very rough and quick. This object is a grid object that we have created in the previous chapter. And here we have simply a grid inside. I can show you. And I want to apply a shader. And since we are in lops, it's not possible to drop down a material um, like in the old OBJ subcontext. So this will not work, especially not for render man. What we need to do is we need to use the material library lob node. And here, that's the best way and works always. And here we need to create a new material. So this library can store multiple different materials and you can distribute and reuse them later in the stream. So let us dive in and here we create a new material builder for Pixar and we will call this MyGrid Material. So MyGrid Mat. And I will choose the Llama Surface, link it to the output and the Llama Diffuse to the first input and I will make it green for demonstration. So now we have this material right here and we see it in the materials on the left, migrant mat. The naming or the, the folder where those uh, materials are stored can totally, is totally up to you. So you can call it mat right here. So mat, but you can also call it my material library. For better reading, it's better to use the underscores and maybe write everything in small letters. My material library, as you see, that's my new material library. So the naming, as I pointed out earlier, is totally up to you. So we can also rename the grid to my grid. So the new folder is my grid, the object is stored to my grid. And now we want to apply the shader. This is very easy. We check um, this assigned geometry right here and we drag and drop the object to this geometry, geometry path. So that's all what you need to do. You only drag and drop or you can write it by hand when you have a component with multiple different meshes inside. So you can also drag and drop the mesh itself. This is much more precise. But we also need to apply the material. And for that, we click on that button. We go to a material library one, how it's called in the uh, lob context. And we choose our migrate material. Check export relative path on and accept. Now we have applied the material.